Alright, what's up everybody? How's it going? Um, it's Rizzo here again. Uh, we'll be doing some stuff in FL Studios again today. I hope y'all had a good week. And, uh, yeah, cool. Hopefully y'all could hear everything correctly. Um, let me actually go and make sure my auto settings are correct. Yeah, I think y'all should be able to hear this. Um, let's see. Cool. Okay, cool. Yeah, um... sure my settings are all right okay cool sweet sounds good so yeah um i think we'll just get uh get down to laying something down um this week i want to kind of try and get some multiple tracks put down here um and last week i was having some issues with volume i was noticing so some tracks are louder than others so i'm gonna there's some simple ways to go around that um and maybe we could do a little bit of that. Maybe we'll have a song or something. We'll see. But, uh, yeah, I found this song. There's this cool new synth I was messing around with uh, here. And it's got all of these... Uh, it's got all these cool different sounds. Um, and, again, this is just like the trial version. So it's kind of cool that it still has these things for you to mess around with. This one is a little quiet, though. That's it at full volume versus, uh, say something like. So yeah, so if I was to record, um, let me just record stuff that I'd hear. It's not even going to sound good. I just want to mess around with volume settings right now. Um, so this is not to like actually, uh, make something that sounds good. And again, I'm going to have to switch it over real quick. So sorry about that. You won't be able to hear me recording it. Um, so let's see. Cool. All right, so I tried to get the most annoying sound I could out of this by basically hitting a chord. Uh, so yep, yeah, that's about it right there. Um, also, one other thing I need to fix is not having the uh, metronome in the recording. Um, I might re-record this because yeah, you can hear the metronome in that. Um, so, hold up one second here. Uh, da, 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 da. Cool. Alright, let's switch back to headphones. Okay. So, yeah, so this was a really loud one. Oh, well. Oh, I don't want to do that. Um, delete that recording, and delete this, okay. oh shoot, um, did I, oh, alright, I think I accidentally deleted it, hold up one second, <laughs> sorry. And now I cannot hear it. Um, okay, here we go. Cool. Alright, options, audio, headphones. Okay, so yeah, so like, you know, say I was just trying to play. Yeah, let's do this. Okay. So, um... Oh. Yeah, so... They do have different volumes. A lot of them you have to go into and actually adjust the volume. Um... So, if I wanted to record over this... Uh, 
wait, you know, I have to switch it back. I would have to, you know, adjust this right here until it's You can actually control the synth through here while you're recording. Um, you can kind of hear the. Oh no. Yeah, something. So yeah, you could hear it modulating. Cool. Um. Also, I thought these kind of sounded cool together. So I'm gonna. Oh wait, I don't think y'all can hear that real quick. Yeah. Let me re-record this real quick. Also... Oh, I have two soldiers. Okay. Sounds like this one is a little lower pitch. Um, let me show y'all. So yeah, so on this one, I'm playing a B flat dominant. Yeah. So this is the chord I'm playing on this one. And if I go here. You could hear it's pitched up just a, a bit. So together they might sound cool. Um, it might be a little bit weird. Um, I'm gonna record real quick and see what it sounds like. I need to adjust that, but I don't think so. We'll see what it sounds like. Cool. That didn't sound too bad. Um, let's see. Oh, no! Don't rear for it. Yeah, it's, I like that kind of the, that fuzziness in the background of, ooh, no, not that one. Oh, this one. So, yeah, okay, cool. Um, so, yeah, you could layer stuff like that. Oh, uh, okay, there you go. Um, oh. So, yeah, you could layer stuff like that. Uh, you can, like, um, hmm, you can pitch correct it too, but there are probably ways of changing the volume in here. Uh, I bet you it's going to be somewhere in here. Like, I already did it on the instrument, so I don't need to do it in here. Um, but there probably is like a, a volume level where you can adjust and make it louder or smaller. You could definitely fade it in and fade it out. Um, I haven't gotten too good at that because you kind of have to like, it, it'll all, it'll fade this, what's ever selected. So if you accidentally select it all and then fade it, it'll fade up to this point right here. Um, so, yeah, cool. Oh, uh, so one thing we can do too is I want to trim this down a little bit. Um, yeah, so I'm going to cut this out right here. Maybe And I don't know why I didn't do that. Oh, I forgot. You have to push it into the thing. You have to do that. There you go. Oh, no. I didn't full screen that. I didn't mean to do that. My bad. Cool. Okay. So, yeah. We get rid of that. Um, and then what we could do. Oh, I didn't record it. Oh. I might re-record it so it, it goes to the three right there. Um. So hold on with me here. Sorry. I do like the combination of those two together. Um. So I might keep those. 
This is a little harsh, I will say. This. So I'm just messing around here. Uh, I don't really have anything in mind to do. Um, so I'm gonna mess around until I find something I like. Kind of like this leaky low pass. Okay, I'm going to try something here, um, I am going to record. So, um, I got this little thing right here. Um, it's a little soft, so I'm gonna re-record that. Um, what was it, harmless? Yeah. I'm gonna re-record that just to be a little bit louder. Um, so, ooh. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, and I just messed that up too, sorry. 
forgot to have the instrument off. Alright, here we go. Okay. Um, yeah, that's just a simple. Cool. Okay. So let's edit this down. Simple. Yeah, cut this. That probably cut that too. Comes in strong. Oh, we want to cut, not copy. And we want to do this. Cut this, and then push that out there. Cool. And this right here we can delete because we don't need it. There. That we can delete. Cool. Okay. So now we have this. Okay, I like the sound of these two instruments. Um, I think it'd be cool to kind of have like this as a little bass or a drum beat in the back. So I kind of want to do something. I just, I, what I'm doing right here is, I have a C dominant chord, um, so it's that, and then, I want to play an F, I think that's an F dominant, Oop, so I could do like that. Could throw an eleventh. Very distant. So yeah, you could do like a. Honestly, this sounds much better if I do it on the piano. Um. Okay. 
Ok. Just trying to figure out a chord progression that I could do for this song. Um, she could. Like, I think a typical one is like one, then four, or you could do four like that, or you could do like that. So. So, I don't know, yeah, I, I think that's fine. Um. So there's two ways I can go about this. Um, I can sit here and record and keep doing that over and over again, or I can try and record and like put them together. Um, I think that's what I'm trying to do. Um, so I'm gonna kill that and we're gonna start over. Um, a lot of this is like just kind of nitty gritty, getting the sounds you want. <laughs> so I apologize if this is getting a little. Uh, repetitive but I think this might be good um, when I get this so let's see let me get this piano up. okay so from here let's cut that uh, cut there we go there it is let's cut this okay cool all right uh now let's see so y'all can hear this um this is what it sounds like. I don't care about the original one. Oh, nope, it's going to wind up. There we go. Cool, yeah. Um, so, yeah. Let me. I'm going to copy this, paste it again. Let's see what it sounds like. Like this. Um. Mm -hmm. All right, these two don't blend together, so I'm going to see if we can blend these two together, so it's like a, you know, did not need to do that. Um, yeah, so one thing that always annoys me that I forget is if you have this actual song sampled here and you hit a note, it's gonna play the song, which is cool, but I always like play and then it's, you can't stop it um, until the song, until this clip's over. But yeah, so, um, okay. So yeah, the what, 
I want it to kind of be like, to sound like this kind of. I just kind of keep it wanting to do that. You know. So what I might do is record a very small this. I have to switch over, my bad. Do settings. Okay, here we go. Okay. I like that last one. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, edit this. So I just get this loud, last sound bit. Um, Hopefully, let me see. Can't even tell from here. Um, whatever. Cool. So, uh, if you, I want to see if I can do something here, so you can just do. Yeah. Okay. So you can hear a little tiny overlap. Um. Oops, I did not want to do that. Uh, there we go. Okay, cool. So what we could do is we could have it like kind of move in like this. Um, I want to see what this sounds like. It's probably going to be really messy. We'll see. Yeah, that was a little messy. Okay. Uh, so now I got to figure out how to kind of move these two together um and i bet you that edison is probably going to allow us to do that and we don't want that so big <laughs> thank you edison um, actually let me think here Hold up one minute. I'm gonna Google something. Okay, so it says it fun hotkey. Um You can. Apparently, there's a hotkey to do it, which is nice. Controls. Controls. Okay. So maybe. Uh, 
Okay, so you can do this. Okay, so you can consolidate it into one. And that means we could just add it from there, which would be nice. Okay, cool. Sweet. Um, cool. Check that out. Sweet. Okay, so now we can go and edit this sample. Aha. So, can you all hear? Let me see. Audio, headphones. Cool. Okay. We want to start from here. Oh! Start from here. Okay. So what we could do is we could fade this. Oh, we could fade this in here, maybe. Um, tools. Where are we fading? Like that. That's a lot. <laughs> that's a lot. Yeah, that's a lot. Um, where's the back button? Ah, uh, yes, great. So it treats select as an, a thing, so it won't let you unfade that, um, of course. But that's okay, we could do, is, no, we don't want to do that. Um, hoo -hoo. that's going to sound weird. Um. Okay, a little messy, uh... What I realized too is that a lot of this at the beginning just sounds like this. So what I might just do is... I might just go like this. And say, from here, let's see. One, two, three, four cut everything out of here so cut that um, cut one two three four and everything past here cut yeah sorry I did a lot of roundabout stuff there and I should have just kept it with this so can do here is we could just do this. So what it does is we can blur this later. Um so yeah so now I can uh Can turn this down a little bit. Instrument. Put this over here.
going to record uh, another chord on this. We have. And we're going to go to. All right, was that it? Wait a minute. Uh, I'm playing an F dominant. Yeah, okay, cool. I don't know my chords off this one. I have to figure out each time. So, what I could do is I could take the... What was I doing here? Ah, I was keeping the... the replacing the third with the eleventh. So it goes from... to... Instead of doing this, we do. So the progression goes from this chord to this. Instead of to. Yeah, I think this is kind of a basic one. That kind of sounds too, like, too basic. Because so. then you would go straight to the, um, the fifth. So. So instead, we're kind of doing something more funky. So. And honestly, I don't like how this one's so loud. So I'm going to kind of keep it here. Also, there is... There is a way to... I think it's with this. But there's a way to link like the physical properties on the keyboard so like for example I have this pitch wheel on the keyboard right I can just like move it up and down instead of having to go in here and do it with my mouse so it'd be cool to be able to do that with the frequency but I'm not too sure um I might google it real quick uh because that would be nice to have um, okay, nothing real quick. Oh well, okay. So yeah, so I'm gonna record. Oh, I need to switch. Sorry, so y'all won't be able to hear this for a second. Sorry, real tech audio, here we go. So yeah, these, like, this is how it sounds without the chord, without, like, me just playing. I don't like that space. So what I could, oh, another way to do this, too, is just to play it and cut it at Edison, because I'm pretty sure, let me try something here. Um, if I, like, cut this, I think it'll put up together. Yeah, see? So you don't get that. So if I were to play this, it'd be like... It's still really hard tr harsh transition. Um, I'm going to play a whole progression in here and see if I can smooth it out in Edison. Um, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I screwed up. 
sorry, I did that thing again. Thank you. So, so I'm gonna start. It's gonna be. Th this is a regular pr blues progression, so I'm gonna be like, play the one, then the four, come back to the one, and then the five in the C scale is the G. So yeah, um. What I'm doing is, I'm in the key of C. So, the first note of C is C. The fourth note of C is F. The fifth note of C is G. So the chord progression I'm playing is a C, 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 F, F, C, C, the fifth, the G, then the fourth, F, C, and then G. But, even though it's in the key of C, you can still have, like, you know, there's this F, but then there's also the F dominant that we were just playing, which is that. So you could still have different notes that are outside of the C scale in your chords. Um, then technically the chords are in a different scale, but it we're just sticking to that 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 one one four five one one pattern. Um, so I'll just. I don't want to confuse anybody, um, and I confuse myself all the time with this stuff, uh, because, hey, if you're in the key of C and you play in F dominant, which is not uh, in the key of C, it's in the key of... Oh boy, it is in a different key, it is in a key with the... E flat and a B flat. Yeah, so F dominant is in the key of B flat. But <laughs> we're playing it with this whole thing in C. So it, it, it gets confusing. Um, like I said, I confuse myself all of the time. Because if I'm playing a song in the key of C and I play an F dominant chord which is in the key of B flat I can improvise on it with a B scale over it but that improvisation is not in the key of C so yeah it gets confusing we're not going to worry about that um, I just went off on the tangent uh, so I need to figure out what G um, what G I want to play so it's going to go and then, so it's gonna do four of these, two of these, two of these, and then it's gonna go to the G, which is. So yeah, um, a G dominant is just that. Uh, so if I'm. My fingers are here, so I could go like that, so it'd be... So it'd be something like that. Um, that's an easy one. Um, I, let me play a G minor. Hmm. So that's the F, that's the G, it's the 
It sounds really close to each other. Um, let me see if. Yeah, I like that. So we'll be doing cool. Okay. Um, let me get this options audio back to real tech. Go. Okay. So let me record this. Cool. That's off. Okay. Cool. Oops, I messed that up. Okay. I'm going to stop that. We're going to kill that, delete that, and try it again. Okay, so. Let's start it. Sorry. Um, okay, cool. Let's see here. And sorry, I have the metronome in it. So, try it again.
Ah, I messed up. Sorry. Um, sorry if y'all can't hear this. Uh, again, it won't let me listen to it and play at the same time. So, uh, or this won't let me listen to it and record at the same time in order for y'all to hear it record. So I'm just going to not let y'all hear it so I can listen to it while I record and y'all can listen to the aftermath. Um, so let me try that again. Okay, here we go. Oh, I messed up again. Cool, okay. I messed up a couple times, but that's okay. I'm going to edit it out. Um, so, the, uh, it really starts around there. Um, so, yeah, it really starts right here. So, I'm going to cut all this out. Uh, cut. Boom. Yeah, so it really starts about right there. Um, That's it. Um, and then it goes back to whatever. So uh, it's a little bit past the 12th bar right there. Um, so I'm going to cut that. Wait, did I? Wait a minute. Okay, so, um, yeah, let's see what this sounds like, um, uh, I'm gonna have, oops, no, I have this on it, but a little bit lower. Yeah, I know the demo. I know the demo.
That'll work. It's something to do. So let me, uh, I want to figure out how to kind of like smooth this down. Um, I know I tried it like two week, two or three weeks ago. Uh, there's like a smooth option where you could like smooth them into each other. Um, I want to try something here for a second. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm counting eight beats there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. So you kind of, what we kind of want to do here is. We kind of, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna, okay. First of all, I'm gonna make a copy of this. Um, so don't screw it up. There we go, okay, cool. So now, um, I'm gonna cut this away here. Um, so now, and I wanna cut it on the fourth beat. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it's like right about there, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep. All right, and then we can cut this too right here. That's so now let's see what it sounds like. Hmm. It's like kind of on beat. It's a little off. Um, definitely because I'm cutting these down, but let's see, let's see what it sounds like. I cut all this down right here. Cut. I really don't like this spike. Oh, I can zoom in. I forgot about that. Uh huh. Um, yeah, so we can do so we can cut this. All the way from here to here. So now it's not too bad. That sounds that sounds okay. Um I'm gonna do some more zooming in. Um Let's see what this sounds like. That 
a little quick, um, but I think that might work better than, oh, I did it again, sorry, um, I played the keys while having selected this, so now it's not going to like me, um, and play the whole song, but that's okay, we'll just wait for it to be over. Okay, cool. Now it's over. Um. I'm gonna try one more thing, um, and then we can start layering. So, oops. Let's copy that, copy that, copy that. Okay, now what we can do is we can trim these down so that they're all one beat long. So one, two, three. wait a minute. Oh man. Uh, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Cool. So you literally just have to cut this off right here. We've got a sound bite. I think this is gonna be much easier. There we go. Um, cool. uh, okay. Um, yeah, I like that. Cool. So we'll put this into there. Delete that. And all right, I'm actually I'm gonna go run to the bathroom real quick. We can take a quick break. I'll be back in like two minutes.
cool. I'm back. Um, let's get back to it. Cool. We were, what we were doing is just getting this, and I was playing the chords and cutting them down. So, I'm going to do that with this one. Edit sample. So, you want it to last from here to... Probably to here, I think. Let me see. There's something so. Now we just need to So I screwed something up here. I think. I like this this one right here. The best. Okay, so you need these to be all the same. Um, hmm. Cool. Um, do like that. So let's see what these sound like one after another. Okay, cool. Um, oh, wait, y'all might not be able to hear this, my bad. There we go. Okay, cool, so, like, if we do something like this, I'm gonna see what it sounds like. Also, let me get this switch in one, just to see. This one is a little short. Um.
See how it drops out in the third? It's just like one, two, three, four, one, two, three, and it cuts. So I'm gonna need to re-record that, and that is something like this. Yeah. So we're just gonna re-record it um, quickly. it up. We do that. Uh, okay, we'll edit this. See what it sounds like. Uh, I want to make sure my timing's correct on this. Um. Cool. So everything outside of here we're cutting. Um, cool. So, oops. What is you want? I want to see. I think this is four beats. You see. Okay, that's 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 okay. So we need two of these, and then we need. I think we need this one right here, let me see. Yep, that's that one. Okay, I think it should be like this. This is really loose, so. Um, I think these are some of these are too long. We'll see.
cool. Okay. Uh, I don't like that. Um, also, there's some weird silence at the end of this. So, I'm going to get rid of that. Yeah, I don't know what in the world is... Like, here, listen to this. I wish there was a way to co completely put them together. There might be. Um, let me see. Yeah. Nope. Right here. One, two, three, four. Where's it here? One, two, three, four. I think it's here. Yep, that's it. Cool. So it's like that. And then so two, one, 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 four, four, wait, one, 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 four, four, one, one, five, four, one, one. Uh, so we need to do an, a recording of four. That's only half.
This is it. Yeah. Oops, I need to do one more. here for one beat. Yeah, I think that'll work. So it sound like this. Alright, now what does it sound when we put it together like this? Probably really bad, but that's okay. Yeah. Ah, uh, see so ya. Yeah, um. I'm going to copy these to another one and then try and see if I can merge it together. Oops. Like some of these work well. It's just like others just don't want to get this last section. This right here? Let's see. Yeah, it's like not like Yeah, hmm. 
could do is so that's the five four one five five four. So I could copy this down here. We could see one, 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 one. Let's see how that sounds. Yeah. Don't like how it went, like, wants me to do that, but that's okay. This is a four. So one, 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 four, four, one, one. Okay, I like that. I think I record so I could do this in the background Oh, it sounds cooler. I'm gonna do both. Um, also, wait, could y'all hear? Ooh, y'all couldn't hear that. Okay, well, this is what it sounds like. And then I'm gonna add, like, something like. right here. Just to clean this up. And then I'm going to record one more thing. more things.
Cool, and then I could just like. Oops. Sounds like this. And we could probably cut this last part out. Cut. Cool. So now what we can do is we can. So this is what it sounds like. Sorry, I'm just like adding songs in the background. Let's see. Hmm. I think that's a good stopping point for today. Um, 
next week I want to kind of get this to be less choppy um with the chords so like as you remember like it's it's hard to like have the chords sound like they're playing next to each other there's a lot of space when I put it together it like messes up with the timing so I want to be able to like you know Yeah. Um, cool. But yeah, thanks for uh, stopping by. Um, like I said, next week I'll probably try and fix on that. Um, and yeah, so yeah, there's a uh, there's a lot of other cool things that are being streamed at the library all throughout the week. So there's video games. Um, people do other media projects and stuff. So feel free to check it and uh, check the li library's website for any like updates and schedules and stuff like that. But yeah, cool. Thanks for stopping by, and I'll see y'all next week. Bye.